Hello and welcome back to Trial and Error 2019. I'm Gracie. And I'm Silke. And today we are trying different types of minces. We've got three fake minces and one real mince. So that we can discover if our vegan friends have some delicious options or if they're really just missing out. And just so you know, we've got a name for them. We call them FIMPS. Fake mince. Let's mm. go. It looks like real mince to me. It smells nice, but doesn't smell meaty. It smells very tomatoey. Cheers. Don't they tell you to not ever eat spaghetti on a first date? And here we are doing it on camera. Oh my goodness. And a first date. <laughs> I don't think that's real mince. That's definitely not real mince. It's yummy though. It doesn't taste fatty or oily. I mean, I've It tastes corny. <laughs> <laughs> it does. It tastes like a little bit like cornmeal. If I was really drunk, I would still think this is mince. <laughs> Ooh, Gracie, what do you think of this one? It looks like mince. Agreed. Doesn't smell as uh, tomatoey. Could have a slight meat, meaty smell. Oh, this actually kind of looks a little bit like cat food. Not as chewy, very soft, and I don't think it's real. And this one is way, this is nowhere near as nice as the one we just ate. Doesn't have as much flavour to it, like it's not, hasn't been seasoned. If I was looking for a meat alternative, I wouldn't go with this one. Guys, I think this is the real mince. It looks I, like I it. I reckon it's real too. Oh yes, the closer I get, the realer it looks. Yeah. This is beef mince from a cow. Agreed. It's delicious and I love it and it tastes familiar. It's not made from any fake proteins. No. Or tofu. It's from the meat of a cow. I wonder if it has like equal amounts of protein or more amounts of protein. Hmm. Insert cow mince protein here. Mm. I don't know if I'm excited for this one. This one's a lot darker colour. First date advice. <laughs> Fork in and swirl the pasta around. It's that doesn't smell like, that smells like fits. It's faux. Oh, no. This is nasty. <laughs> that texture's all wrong. I don't like this at all. This is my least favorite. It's like cat food with tomato sauce on it. I don't like that either. No. Sorry. I'm gonna be honest, I thought it was pretty obvious which one was the real mints. It was number three. What do you reckon? Yep, number three was the real mints. And it was probably my second favourite. I like the first mints, the best mints. Oh, so Gracie, your favourite one was the Gardein one. I really liked it. So it must be made out of some sort of vegetable extract and um, delicious stuff that doesn't have meat in it. And then number two, which is the one we didn't really, really like, that one is the brand Corn. And that's made out of mushrooms. Yeah, it was kind of a mushier, blander texture. Yeah. And what was number three? Mints! From a cow. Not fence. Mints. <laughs> and that was your favourite? Mm. Nice. Veggie Delight was number four. So those are the ones that you see in the fridge section. They've been around for ages. 